So I'm home, I had a really nice lunch from my grandma, I didn't vlog too much of it but I am just about to leave out again because I've been here for a little while and Matt is outside, um, Liverpool and Everton were playing and he supports Liverpool so you know, I had to go and watch that, I had lunch with my grandma which was a lot more enjoyable for me. Carby foods today, um, so I'm very full and I will not eat anything now for the rest of the day because I'm literally just like, I feel like I've got a lovely... Um, food baby brewing in here about to pop so i've got vampire diaries on because i'm making the most of it being on netflix and i'm on season five episode one and yeah i'm literally gonna do a full skincare routine full blown pamper because my mental health and anxiety has been really really bad the last like week it's got bad again it, it goes through stages and phases you know um but i've got vampire diaries on which is a real comfort thing for me because i find one of my anxiety is bad comfort things is what sort of helps um especially when i'm at home so got this on go to a full skincare blowout um i've got a really nice healthy dinner which should help me because i haven't really eaten properly in the last like four days i gonna be honest um and that doesn't help either so i'm gonna go watching this and have a nice salad with a cold fish cake because if you don't know then you will know now i love that dinner combination um so yeah and i'm just gonna organize a few bits I'm also going to spend a bit of my evening organising this again. It won't take long. As I said, this drawer always gets into a mess. Um, and it's really, really annoying. So I'm just going to quickly organise it. It won't take long. Just like that, it's all organised. And if you want to know, wonder why I've got a random rock in here, it's from Cornwall. Um, I know something very naughty. I know I only took one. Um, but it's from the beach. But when we, the first time we went back, so it's a couple of years ago now, which is just crazy. And um, the first time we've been back since my grandma passed away and the beach that we... Oh my God, my hair. Right. <laughs> anyway, I'm at the beach where we scattered some of the ashes. This is where I got this from. And I know it's bad. I do not spread the word about taking rocks from beaches, obviously, because, you know, the beaches need it. But it was... It's no excuse. I shouldn't have done it. But it's just like the memory. That's all. It's only one. Um... But yeah, so I've got all my scrunchies in here. Um, I'm not going to lie, the Primark ones are nice, but they're nowhere near as good quality as um, sweet pea scrunchies. Mum's made a salad. A bit of a sneak peek, and she's put... <laughs> I love how you put the celery and spring onions. <laughs> I'm a pain in the bum. Pardon? <laughs> I just said that's how much she loves me, because I'm really fussy. Spring onions are okay, to be fair, it's just not my favourite. I'd rather not have them in a salad. And I cannot stand celery. Cannot stand it. I used to love it as a child. Like me and my granddad used to, like, I'd have celery and like hummus and that. But now, no. Um, and then we've got a, which one? There we go. I don't know where you can see them. But some cod fish cakes and they smell great. So yeah, I'm really excited for this. Because as I said, I haven't really eaten properly in the last like four days, which is not good. So here's my dinner. And I forgot to mention, I've got my Primark haul up on private and my current obsessions. The only nearly edited, so that's going to go up onto private too. So I felt quite productive. Um, but, yeah. It's all, it's all done, pretty much. Thumbnails made, ready to go up. And schedule, because I'm going to see when people want them. Um, I'm going to schedule them. But yeah, I'm really looking forward to this. So I have lit my candle. I've chosen this one. Um, because I'm saving my festive one for nearer to Christmas. Probably start in November. Um, but this is a good vibes only, which is from Superdrug. Um, it's orange and pineapple with vanilla mixed in, but it doesn't smell very vanilla y which is why I actually surprisingly like it, because I don't like vanilla-based candles. I think it's because it's got a mix of the orange and pineapple, is why I probably like it. Um, but yeah, so... <laughs> Oh, 
oh I look grim it is Tuesday the 20th of October I can't believe how quick this month is going I quickly popped to my local shop which is basically like a mini supermarket and um I have bought some Hagen dazs ice cream and some hummus because I'm gonna have a little snack in a bit but I'm gonna wash my hair have a bit of a pamper do my face mask around my nose because we have to wear a mask at work my skin's just so dry and yuck um but yeah so I'm home now and I've got two days off and I'm gonna chill really so I'm gonna stop being lazy it is so autumnal today especially this afternoon slash evening it's five o'clock and it's blue skies the trees are yellowy and orangey and it's just oh I'm so weird like that but I'm gonna try the Primark super blends smooth and sleek shampoo I have had a comment on there from Emily um, on my Primark call saying she loves the Primark um, shampoos and I definitely think you should give them a go like don't get me wrong if you have particular hair needs then obviously get the hair care that you need however that is specialised for your hair because I do want to try functional beauty at some point because loads of influencers that I love have got discount codes um so I thought we might as well save a bit of money um because it's not the cheapest hair products um but it's supposed to be really good however I got this one and it is with coconut and keratin it's a smooth and sleek and it's only a pound um so I'm going to use this chest test it out and also I'm going to do a hair mask so it's not like a full-on first impression because Okay. um it's not full on first impression because my hair does need a hair mask desperately but i really want to try a new shampoo um because i love the pound shop um hair care um argan oil shampoo it's brilliant i absolutely love it some people don't get on with it feel like there's nothing for their hair for me it literally just gives my hair this intense treatment and for the whole pot it's only a pound um so yeah my hair care routine is not expensive the most expensive hair products i've got is john frieda and I will still continue to buy John Frieda. However, I'm going to give this a go and let you know what I think. Um, I could get 250 ml product, so we'll give it a go. And I'm going to do an old school video at some point. I'm going to do a whole empties video. I'm going to collect more of my trash um, of products that I've used up um, and review them because stuff like this, which is so super cheap, some people won't get on with, some people will. And I think it's good to hear a variety of opinions so you can base your own. And for a pound, you can't really grumble. So if you're new to my channel, this is the hair mask that I've been obsessing over. Um, it's the hydrating hair mask with Moroccan argan oil extract um, and it's an intensive conditioning treatment obviously it's going to be hit and miss with people it's only a pound um, but I really really like it personally for me um, and yeah that's the hair mask that I'm going to be using I try to use it once or twice a week I've been really lax and trust me my hair has been showing me that it needs it because I haven't used it in like two weeks and that's just not good I need to be more consistent with using it because my hair I do notice a difference when I don't use it. I'm using in the shower, so I'm using the Super Blends shampoo, um, a new one I've got, and I'll let you know what I think. I love the smell, it smells amazing. And then I'm using the Colour Protect Conditioner. Um, I really like this. Um, it makes my ends and my hair feel really lush. Um, and then I'm using the Strawberry Body Shop Shower Gel, which Malika very kindly gifted me. Um, and in our Christmas swap, I will definitely be giving her some Body Shop stuff. Again, has some bits because she made me obsessed with the brand um, and I will definitely be asking for some body shop strawberry items because especially a shower gel because this is just amazing it's lasts so long which is why I think it's worth the money because it's eco-friendly animal cruelty like cruelty free um, vegan friendly it's just amazing product in a bottle amazing for your skin and I'm really sensitive to skin and thankfully it works well with me um, and it smells delicious like you can literally I feel like I want to pour it in my mouth and eat it obviously I can't do that um, but yeah so Primark hair combo. Really simple makeup, like this light in this kitchen makes me look awful with or without makeup. But I've grabbed my hummus from the fridge and I'm going to take it into my room. I don't know actually why I'm taking a tray. I'm being way too extra. Um, yeah, I'm going to have some hummus and I'm going to have it with some Dorito chips um, or tortilla chips. And then I'm going out, but I'm wearing the most comfiest casual outfit going. I'm wearing this Primark oversized jumper and these Miss Selfridge joggers, which are really nice and comfy. So comfort is key. So it is Wednesday, the 21st of October, and I've been helping my mum all morning. Um, but I have just recently been talking to Malika on WhatsApp, which has been really nice. So I may or may not have cheated and finally caved to watching Zoe's old vlogmases. So I'm going to finish my red pepper hummus. Um, that I bought from the co-op and I am using my Fortnum and Mason mug for a cup of coke because why not um, and I've got my Doritos slash tortilla chips 
and then I might have some ice cream and I'm gonna watch some Harry Potter. So I'm about to head out, oh my god, this is not good lighting. Um, and I've got a super casual outfit on. I've got my Miss Selfridge joggers on, my Miss Selfridge oversized knitwear jumper. Um, and I'm literally, oh, okay, I'm literally about to head out. Um, but I've literally been spending the whole afternoon, like late afternoon, I watched some Harry Potter and now I've been watching some Jaclyn Hill videos. Now, if you know, I used to love her. I used to love her channel, her content, everything. And then for some reason, I just stopped watching her videos and then there was loads of drama, loads of whatever um, that went on. I just, I just don't like that kind of vibe, even though she, it wasn't necessarily all her fault or whatever. I just, it kind of stresses me out without meaning to stress me out. It's very easy to stress me out, put it that way. Um, but I've been re-watching, like I've been catching up with some of her newest uploads. I want to re-watch some of her old videos from like four years ago because they were amazing. Um... So yeah, um, but I've packed my bag. I say my bag, I've just got a Debenhams bag with my laptop, my toiletries so I can have a bit of a pamper and um, sort of like some loungewear to sleep in. Um, so yeah, but I'm having takeaway tonight. I don't know what time though, not yet a while because I am literally so full right now. It's not even a joke. I don't even know how I'm full. I just am. So yeah, I'm not hungry yet a while, but I'm going to see Matt and I have done an Instagram story of assumptions so hopefully we're going to get some relationship based assumptions in because I'm going to film a get ready with me tomorrow when I come home um, and my makeup collection so I've got two main videos to go up on my channel whilst I'm working my shifts because then my consistent uploading will not be smudged Um, I will still be uploading which will be good um, and I'll edit them both tomorrow I'll just bash it out and get them on private ready um but yeah because everybody wants my primark shopping and poundland haul vlog up on friday and i really want to upload it friday if i upload it friday then i've got no other content to upload and i don't want that to be the case for a week um a week not may not sound like a long time but for me that's quite a while not to upload now since i've been uploading at least twice or even three times a week um for the last like, couple of months now so yeah um i'm gonna be going and chilling and i'm sure i'll film a little bit there um, and show you my order. If you didn't know, my classic order I get every single time I go to Chinese is chicken chow mein with no onions, but extra bean sprouts, can of coke, and prawn crackers, and potentially some mini spring rolls, but it depends. Um, but tomorrow is going to be a very exciting day, which I might add into this vlog or I might start a new vlog, who knows? Um, because I'm going to be shopping for my collaboration video with Amber. Um, our autumnal swap which we're exchanging next week she's really prepared she's done all mine we've set ourselves a budget but i'm going to talk about it all in that vlog um because i'm going to shop for everything in that vlog i'm gonna wrap everything and all of that fun stuff because we're exchanging it next wednesday so i really need to get a move on with that because she always does it well in advance and i'm really late so yeah i think actually yeah i will just film a whole vlog about that because i think it's a really nice collaboration video and i've got so many swaps by at the end of this year like christmas swaps like i'm like oh my god which is why i'm going to talk to you about an app later on in this vlog that has saved me with christmas shopping so so much um and there's a shout out to one of my girls who i used to be so close close with here on youtube because she introduced me to this app it's a version of home bargains and it's just insane it will save your christmas like it be amazing for like stocking fillers and stuff like that because i'm gonna be doing a massive haul when i make my order put it that way so it is like half past 10 oh there we go um and i have decided that i'm going to upload my um shopping haul vlog that i really am happy with i think there's certain things i'm a lot happier with when i upload them on private or upload them on my channel like i love all my videos obviously but i think there are some that i like prefer more than others you know for whatever reason and this is one of my favorite vlogs for a while um primark shopping and poundland haul um it's got loads of other things got a really exciting package from bethany her lip oils and stuff like that um so you would have seen it before the time you see this vlog be the vlog before this one um and yeah i'm really looking forward to uploading that that'll be on friday at 3 p.m because uh, i finished work at one um so yeah um and then i'm gonna when i go home tomorrow I'm going to film my makeup collection and my get ready with me because loads of people are sending assumptions about my relationship, which thank you so much. If you're watching this and you know you are one of those people, I'm going to make my boyfriend's face in the bed for a minute. Um, if you know you are one of those people, thank you so much. 
um, because it does mean a lot because um, a lot of them are hilarious um, and some of them are going to spill the tea a little bit about family situation as well um, so yeah, if you're wondering where this is from it's like a bralette style thing it's from Anne Summers it's really nice I've got a matching bodysuit um, but anyway uh, yeah so that's fun and then I'm really excited to film the vlog tomorrow because obviously that's going to be me buying Amber's gifts and all of that and by the time she opens her stuff she'll see that vlog so i'll make sure i upload it after she's opened all her bits and pieces um but yeah i'll film the swap unboxing as well of her stuff next wednesday when we exchange it but i'm really excited to show you guys when you see it um the vlog of me buying the gifts anyway of me wrapping them buying them all that kind of stuff and um, i'm going to put a lot more effort into that last time last time i left it too last minute um so yeah but that's the fun stuff um and i've got as i said i've got such a busy week from this friday onwards like seven eight days i'm gonna be so tired but it's all worth it in the end the grind doesn't stop um but yeah matt's in the shower and i'm just chilling i watch a bit of tiktok honestly please tell me i'm not the only one i go on tiktok for like 20 minutes next thing i know it's like four hours later and since my tiktok is full of harry potter stuff it's just like it's just hard it's just really addictive so yeah but i hope you enjoyed this vlog don't forget to smash a big thumbs up subscribe if you have not already um don't forget when i hit 1700 subscribers there will be a bundle giveaway not too sure what kind of bundle. it won't be my primark one but it'll be a really exciting bundle giveaway um because you know we're getting there slowly and it's just the next step really to 2k which i'm really excited about because there's gonna be a huge giveaway when i hit 2k there's gonna be loads of different bundles there'll be multiple winners um and i'm really really excited about that so yeah um and you'll probably be able to enter via instagram and youtube which is gonna be exciting so it broadens the horizons of who can enter there'll probably be like 10 winners or something like that something quite epic and large because that's a big milestone i'm still quite away i'm like 300 odd subscribers away from that that's not that many if you think about it so spread the word um so yeah um and put it this way it's a sneaky sort of like preview to it my chrissy teagan becca palette which has been barely touched will be one of the prizes and that's worth like nearly 50 pounds and it's limited edition you can't get your hands on it anymore um i'll show it in my next vlog um but yeah so remember that um and yeah thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next vlog or video whichever one you watch first bye <laughs>